You yeah. still remember he's the farter. He will always be the farter. He'll never be the farter I in my book. I farter. I fart. I my, fart on my... My farter. Let me tell you about... Yeah, my farter. My farter. My farter. <laughs> love, to, love to eat Brussels sprouts. Do Brussels sprouts make them stink? Uh, I bet you'd get some big stinky... Um, Cauliflower does. You know what's... You know what's... Uh, I'm thinking about is every time we do a video, the last, like, while, we look at that farter and then the first topic... Is I think we've talked about <laughs> farting in every video with that character. <laughs> it's actually fucking with our psyche. I mean, yeah. Like, it's impacting... It's it, imp it kinda is that fucking thing's fault. Is the first I think we talked about see. farts as a result of that guy. I think every time he's been there. It's subliminal messaging. Subliminal messaging. Subliminal. Subliminal. I mean, I'm. I'm because I subliminally like brainwash you daily. Do you know that? No. I'm like, in a party I'm a of disliking crumb. it. Give me an example or something. Well, you know when I take that watch out and I say you are getting very sleepy. No, We're I don't everything. remember that. Well, exactly. So that's what I was trying to explain to you. I gotta rescue ten chows. Fuck. What did you do? It's not what I what did, Chris. Did you it's do? about what you what did. What did you do to me? Chris, it's about what you did. What this did isn't I about do? me. Let's just say I had some errands I needed to be taken care of. <laughs> I needed to air out some And let's uh, just skeletons. say you're a good little <laughs> <laughs> That's a good start. <laughs> Tried fucking homing and tagging. Hey, but... wait a minute. You know what's interesting? You know what's happened since the last episode? Huh? We've oh, seen no, the Sonic it's movie too. We saw Sonic 2 the movie. We saw Sonic 2 oh, we last, saw it night. last night. Yeah. 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 Go on, Corey. Corey, you want to talk about it? You want to give me a big fat review? Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. well, um, yeah. I'll just say that it, for the most part, I didn't like it. I thought it was terrible. But I liked <laughs> some of the things in it. Like, I liked the, you know, I liked the references. Okay, just before we start. <laughs> before, I like the references. Before, well, yeah, what references? I just want to say this. I, I want to, like, pre prefix this. Yeah. We're going to spoil the fuck out of it. So if you haven't seen yeah, it. Yeah, skip to this time on screen if yeah. you want to skip the Sonic talk. We'll keep this. Yeah. This just ends the episode. We'll keep, yeah, I was going to say, we'll keep, we'll keep it with We're going to talk hey, You know what? I'll start a timer so that the, the talk doesn't go across two whole episodes. Okay, yeah. I'm going to start a five minute timer right now. And when that timer is done, we'll stop talking. Because I'm, I'm going to spoil it. Because there's not much all right, I could say. Five minutes, Corey, go. We have to all review it. Now, 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 now. Okay, my review. Okay, I, I liked all the stuff with like Sonic, Tails, and Knuckles, obviously. I thought Knuckles was really... Fuck, grab it, you dipshit. No, fuck. Um, I thought Knuckles was really interesting. I liked uh, Idris Albus, whatever the fuck his name is, uh, yep. take on Knuckles. I thought Robonic was okay. He was a little more hammy than the first one, and he said a lot of really cringy Zoomer shit that was awful. Yeah, he didn't make me laugh once in the second yeah, one. I, I was, think he made me smile once, once he, in the first he, movie. He, and I was like, I, I was like, I was like, I was like mildly part. entertained by the first movie. I'm not, a, I'm not a huge Sonic fan. The first movie sucks too. This movie, I was, I was bored out of my mind. It's terrible. Like, ha like <laughs> they, they kept cutting away from the little animated characters to like the people. Yeah, and the people. I did not go to, to 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 see Sonic to see the the humans. And I think it's clear what happened was that human the sheriff character whose name I forget. Tom. They DeLong, wanted that. They wanted him Chris out. Chris Pratt. Yeah, Chris Pratt. They wanted him out of the movie. Uh, I think that, seriously, I don't think they want, but they're like, we have to write him in because he's like an integral character to the he's first Sonic's movie. He's Sonic's dad. Yeah, now what I think they're going to do <laughs> yeah. is they're going to make you, a third dad. one, and they're going to, at the end of the third one, they're going to write him out and say, they're oh, gonna goodbye. Kill he's going to die in a horrible he's car He's going to wave accident. away at them, and they're going to go, they're going to go. going to keep the sassy fat woman because she's fucking yeah, hilarious. Yeah, yeah. She brought, yeah. every, Fuck. every time I was about to fall asleep, she said something that jolted me out of my the, seat with there's laughter. two people <laughs> that will make you Don't fucking... mess up my wedding. I said, that's a fucking funny idea. Don't mess up my wedding. That was hysterical. I literally stood up and clapped. Go ahead. There's two people who will make you laugh hysterically. It's his loser friend, um, the police oh, officer, who God. isn't funny at all. He's got the little helmet has, on. like, one of the worst deliveries, one of the worst jokes. He's literally was just, like, when he was on, I swear I had, like, a mini stroke. He was so unbearably stupid. All he did was make the same fucking Zoomer jokes and, like, the same crap about, like, Stay Puft Marshmallow Man. <laughs> oh, like, God, he yeah. wasn't relatable at all. He was annoying. But can I say asshole. something as well? I had a revelation. I was, we, were, we watched it as a little group. It was a few of us. And I turned to our friend Adam, <laughs> like halfway through, and I just got a sinking feeling. I said, "I think we're too old to be like." <laughs> yeah, oh, absolutely. I don't think I should. I'm, I don't think I'm supposed to be watching this. Like, yeah, you just, know what I mean. Yeah. I do want to prefix and say, but that I don't think the first movie was like that. No, no, it was more of a family movie. This movie felt like it was for young, young children. The, the writing was too like they made the humans too witty. Like they any any fucking screen time the humans had, they needed to eat up the fucking scenery. And I, by the way, I don't, I don't mind like. watching something for kids, but I just felt like, oh, I really shouldn't be watching this and like. <laughs> I don't know why I just got that. It was like if I was watching Yo Gabba Gabba or something. Yeah, it was bad. <laughs> I was I, like, I'm not, I'm not the intended, but maybe that's not 
you know. It's definitely made for kids, but that's still no more, excuse. More so than the first movie. I think they made a strategic, like, financial decision where they said, all right, the first movie, did, we thought it was going to be a bomb. And you know what? I'll give, I'll give the first movie props for taking that movie, and, that, which was idea. supposed to be complete see. shit, and reworking it. You guys are not addressing the elephant in the room. What? Is that we are a bunch of fucking online animators, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. and, and we, a- we are subjected to online animator Twitter, where every fucking grown adult is like, Sonic 2 was actually fucking Oh yeah, amazing. no, I, I remember- It was actually really good, it was way better! <laughs> I, I was so fooled when I, when I saw that shit, like it was- I was going into it ready to be entertained, I wasn't going into it cynically. Yeah. I, don't, I try not to ever go do movies cynically, you know what I mean? Where you I mean, go into it to hate it. I just want to specify, like, I know it's for kids. There were some things I liked. It was mostly, you know, say, like... We have two minutes left. Say the positives. Yeah, yeah. Like, aside oh, sorry, from, we have 15 seconds, Court. Okay, the positives was, like, anything with, like, the dynamic of Sonic and Tails. Um, I fucking Sonic, hated Tails, Tails, Sonic Tails and Knuckles. Eight seconds left, guys. Final thoughts. I like Knuckles. Final, I, hated I Tails. like Knuckles. Knuckles is great. Sonic I'm was fun- all- do you, recommend, do you recommend no, the answer? No, no, no. But I am looking forward to the Paramount movie. And I guess I would recommend right. it if you're well, a Sonic fan, Sonic but not talk, everybody. Actual... Thank you for skipping this point if you did. Yeah. You missed a lot of great stuff. It was great. It was funny as hell, it was, dude. It was hysterical. I, I just want to say... Maybe the funniest stuff we've ever said. It's just frustrating because it's like... Yeah, everyone I know is like, it's better than the first one. And then I, I kind of went in with like thinking it would be better. <laughs> there are scenes that are better, but overall, I think... The humans were more subdued in their humor. I feel like like some class. Nobody's clown watching that for, the, for the humans. Nobody cares. Yeah, the humans but... were awful. Our Twitter did the same shit for Turning Red. Never saw that. And one. Mitchell's versus the machines. I actually like Turning Red. I just don't want. I don't want to <laughs> you about liked it. it. It was good. Yeah. And you're off the fucking couch. Uh, <laughs> 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 it stays on the couch. Screams. <laughs> Chris, there was a point where uh, there were people <laughs> two, two rows behind us that were literally going, ah, ah, like screaming, laughing. Was, at the fed yeah, woman. Yeah, it was at the wedding. It and wasn't it was even like ironic. comedy oh, jokes. Oh, 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 I will say we're still talking about it, even though we said okay, it's skip. fine. But w- there was this is the last thing I will say about it. That that wedding part was so bad that the theater did collectively <laughs> seem. I think it was sarcastic. Started sarcastically clapping because there was like there was a part of the wedding where the guy says like. It was it wasn't you know wasn't me that it was it was you it was like so you know some stupid movie line. Oh no yeah it was just like like even though it, I was fake I still love you. Yeah the love was yeah, yeah. Every, right to you. Everyone started applauding and I, I partook so it. I was I, I was like I, I was the only one it. going boo. Yeah Corey Brown Sonic. Sonic. Boo, that was I me. didn't want to see the blue blur. I wanted to see people at a wedding. <laughs> I will say one last thing, just to really reiterate. Um, go the, on. The shadow reveal. I was very excited to see. Corey did start jumping up and down. Because you did. I you did. were like a little giddy he kid. He really was. Um, I did because I called it. I was really excited to know that. Like he did I, call it. It's almost obvious. Like Damn. I knew it was like obvious. It was either Metal Sonic or Shadow, but I was really happy with the major reveal. I was happy with the reveal, but they also like blew their load by showing his fucking yeah, they eyes. Open. They should have shown the They showed the whole fucking. They should have shown him do or something. And it looked like shit, by the way. Wait, 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 they, these they, are they, massive spoilers. They, I don't care. They reskinned <laughs> Sonic. They reskinned him. Yeah, it was a reskin. I, I think it'll look better in the actual movie. Oh no, no, you wanna know something? What? When that movie what? came out, because Sonic fans can't keep their fucking dick in their pants, Shadow was literally like, like fucking trending on Twitter, because everyone, <laughs> everyone and their fucking grandma was like, Shadow is at the end, and they were showing screenshots with a bunch of people clapping. <laughs> I will say, movie experiences are kind of They're always ruined, terrible. Because no, every video, time oh. I go to it, it's like, I don't care if I'm experiencing, experiencing, it, I can't talk. <laughs> <laughs> when I'm angry, I can't talk. I, I don't care if I'm experiencing it with a bunch of people who are like, oh, uh, you know, Avid Sonic fans. It's annoying when like, cause they're not kids. Oh, by the way, I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> I didn't even read the mission. I like that visual with that sentence. Yeah, I don't know what I'm doing. Zip, zipping down this little I, I, I really don't know the visual of what I should be doing right now. But yeah, Chris, you've, you've all, I'm sure you've talked about it, but your theater experiences. But yeah, we oh, were I'm sat, we were keys. sat okay. right uh, in front of these people laughing hysterically, not ironically. It's always like that. And Chris though. then turned, we turned, I turned to him when I heard that, and he looked at me and he said, It's like Marvel movies. These people like, were fucking idiots. <laughs> And it made me laugh really hard. Dude, dude, oh, Probably the man. hardest I laughed in the movie. Actually, no. The I'm hardest, that that I did no, 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 no. The hardest the I movie. fucking laughed was this, like, wholesome scene with Tails and Sonic, and then fucking, uh, Adam... Palone? Yeah, Adam Palone went... <laughs> oh, yeah, no, no, the only no, no, person no, no, in the no, whole no. fucking was, audience. There was a point, there was a point where, like, you see, like, the mother owl, and it was dead silent, it was and silent. Adam went... 
And then, <laughs> and then so I heard Corey like laugh funny. out loud. Like, I lost it, dude. I was like six people away from Corey, but I heard him laugh. And it, made, it was like a chain reaction. That was Just so seeing that stupid owl and hearing him laugh at it. I would give everything to it's experience because everything that Adam Tales says, fucking Everything Tales says sounds so stupid, it's like, Oh my, uh, it long claw. <laughs> Everything's delivered the same way. Yeah. Well, she's a voice actor, I don't think she's a movie star. Don't give a fuck. Uh, come on. I'm a movie star. She got me sad. saying. She likes sad. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> they got me saying. Whoa. <laughs> I don't That's what give up, a isn't fuck. it what up? That was Job B. Yeah. Shout, shout out to Jabi. Whatever happened to the that The greatest fella? rapper in Ohio? <laughs> Jabi. Question mark? Oh, fuck, I know Jabi. Corey, that was like our favorite video. We, we watched that over and over. It's been a while, but once you said Jabi, I remember. <laughs> what a... That's a, that's a fantastic video. Oh, I love that video. I also love it because I look at the back and I'm like, that looks like where I grew up. So yeah. it's like, I knew kids exactly like that. Yeah, and like they all abandoned him halfway through the video. I know they're just like, all right, dude. Yeah, we're gonna go home and eat. Good luck. They're clearly being forced to do it against their no will. No loyalty in his little group. They're loyal. They're no, just sick no, of his no, shit. No, man, they wasn't loyal yeah, to Jobby. You know how many times no, they man. probably had if, a run dude, for If, I, if I, Jobby was my friend, I'd be, I'd be at his fucking feet. I'd be licking the dirt between his toes. I'd be licking toes. the dirt just, just for the, just for the opportunity of it. That scene would be omitted in his music video. <laughs> It'd be the last scene. <laughs> Suck on my toes, man. I don't give a fuck. His friends are <laughs> loyal, dirty ass scrapers. <laughs> yeah, you guys are fucking ass scrapers. <laughs> <laughs> butt pounders, whatever you want to add. Dirty butt pounders. <laughs> hilly, hilly ass scrapers. The dirty laps pullers. Uh, the dick smackers, ass pounders, butt lickers. <laughs> butt lickers, yeah. Rose oh, sniffers. I, I wasn't paying attention. I need rump so many, rammers. I need so many keys. Corey. We're sorry, rump rammers. Rump rammers? <laughs> rump I said rum. Rumpus humpers. Yeah, rumpus humpers. <laughs> You dirty rumpus humpus. That sounds like a fucking <laughs> it's a Dr. Seuss book. <laughs> the rumpus humper. Oh, it's funny. You talk about Dr. Seuss. I have something to tell you about Dr. Seuss. Go on. You show me a song from the Lorax, the uh, demo version of the. It was like the beginning or whatever. Biggering. Dude, that shit is that shit bombs. Well, you that song is all fucking the hair awesome. Set up on you like that little 3D cat test, right? Compared to that, how <laughs> eh, 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 Compared Get to that me. fucking song, which yeah. is just like it's okay, but it's like a mild baby song. That shit was dope. Like the the one. The beginning. Bigger. Can I can I say something that'll get me buried up to my neck and sand and have rocks thrown in my head? Don't say deserving racist so. rhyme. Yes. Yeah, but go on. I never see the Lorax. It sucks. Oh, it sucks. You mi you're missing nothing. But yeah, we, I, I wasn't gonna bury you your head in fucking sand. I was uh, that worried. movie sucks ass. <laughs> that really is a, a stinky movie. But Danny DeVito is the Lorax, right? In real life, yeah. Yeah, I'm the Lorax. Look up the look up the beginning demo. Don't actually look up how bad could I be. Biggering. I didn't say that. <laughs> I know. That's what it's called. It's biggering. What, the beginning or biggering? Biggering. Really? That's what it's called? <laughs> it's a cute play on words because he's making his everything is bigger. Bigger. B it's biggering. Biggering isn't a word. I know. That's it. Is that the joke? That's what makes it iconic. That's what makes it like childish and cool. Um, 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 biggering doesn't sound quite right, boring. so I'm not going to you learn the lesson. You zipped off the edge there. I know, but I, I knew I had to go back there. So, you know, whatever. At first, I what didn't else? realize. See, you are singing. Oh! It. Ooh. Oh, I have to ask. I think we talked about this at one point. It's not really in the same context, but. More questions? Okay. No, it's not really a whatever. question. It's just like we were talking about uh, Drake and Josh at one point. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yeah. And I saw a documentary of Drake. Do you guys know what happened with Drake? Yeah. It's kind of interesting. I, I, I kind of only remember where he was like calling out Justin Bieber because he's like. You know, he's he was like, calling out Justin yeah, Bieber. Yeah, he's like, your music sucks and it's only for kids, which is, you know, <laughs> calling the kettle black, I might add. <laughs> he, but, uh, he, he, you know he's huge in Mexico, right? That, yeah, yeah, that's like, it, that's massive, it. Massive. Yes, like, yes. Massive in so, Mexico. So the whole, like, grooming thing incident happened because of that. Like, he, he ended up, like, changing his name to, like, El Draco or whatever the fuck. So he can, like, appeal. No, like, no, no. I think he was big in Mexico before that. He just really no, leaned he into it. Yeah, no, he really moved into it. He, like, changed his identity to be that. What's happening? Can I he go He got a it? Mexican implant. Yeah, Mexican implant. <laughs> yeah. You know the weird thing about how they were gonna do here. a Drake and Josh reboot, uh, and, and, and Josh Peck wrote it, and it was called Josh and Drake, 
And it was it was about it, it was, was pretty about degrading, it, honestly. Yeah, yeah, no, no, no. It gets worse. But it was about how Drake, fictional Drake, was like a failed musician who's big in Mexico. <laughs> oh yeah. And, li- and, and literally how Josh is like a successful real estate agent. <laughs> you yeah, know, and Josh and, wrote that. I don't think Josh is a very nice guy. No, no, and, honestly. And, I don't and, think he and, likes Drake. And the fact, Mexico stuff was seeing... like all. It's like cartel. Like it's like stereotypical Mexican. Like <laughs> the cartel. And, like drugs. And Drake was like, oh, I'm gonna offend all of my Mexican audience with this. I'm not doing that. Yeah, he's like, and he's fuck like, I'm you not, then. I'm not. Yeah, fuck off then. He's like, if you don't do this, then you don't have a career yeah yeah obviously what drake did was fucked up but i think josh is kind of a piece of shit too dude there's videos online a, that's a weird power move to do that to it's go, just mean now i'm the big yeah yeah it's just it, you're petty now the f- shoes on the other foot no, wait, all i know is josh play. peck was in uh yeah, red dawn yeah, the reboot oh i remember that which sucked, sucked. It's <laughs> north korea instead of russia a country of like how many few million people yeah north korea is going to be jumping on the california border soon oh god they damn should it. But that's way less interesting of a plot than fucking the Soviet Union, a massive country that spanned all of, like, Siberia and, and Eastern Europe. Remember that movie where Josh is on the boat and he calls everyone a f- Shut the fuck up, Clyde! You fit, fucking skinny, butt-munching skin. Prance around school talking about your fucking skinny fairy father. I fucking hope they fucking die of fucking disease. No, <laughs> that movie rocks. What's he called? Oh, I know what you're talking about. Don't they push him over? Then they, it's like. Well, spoiler, Corey. No, I mean, <laughs> you already spoiled the best part. You're right. He calls. <laughs> that's the peak. <laughs> what, what are you talking about? There's a movie where Josh plays a really mean bully, and, and these kids at school are like, "We're gonna take him out on a boat and bully him back." No, it's pretty old. He was like yeah, still fat. Old. Wait, was it was it the movie The Whack or whatever? Yeah, or the, it's the, the Whack. The Whack. The Whackening. The Whackening. The Biggering. The Biggering. Yeah, the Biggering. <laughs> Yeah, well, that was accurate. that was his first movie where he's like, I'm not Josh anymore. Yeah. I'm Josh, the actor. Exactly. I mean, he was kind of like he was their worst friend. He was a friend of me, I guess you would call it. And then it was kind of like, I know what you did last summer for babies. But then they bring him out on the boat and uh, they, they, they like uh, they start acting really nice to him. But then but then he comes out of his shell and he's actually kind of a nice guy. I actually don't remember that movie, but I don't think that's what happens. I just remember it coming out, but I never <laughs> I think saw something it. Else that is something. what happens. No, they go out on the boat. Spoiler: they go out on the boat and they're like, "This guy bullies us, so we're gonna bully him." So they they concoct a plan. But then when they bring him out on the boat. That, like he comes out of his shell and he's actually being nice. And they're like, you know, what? let's not go through with the plan. You're, you're lying. But then one of the guys is like, fuck it, we're going through with the plan. And then they're all like, no. And that's yeah, what that's happens. what happens. Yeah, they they take his life. You're right. That is what happens. Well, spoilers. I didn't know that movie was about. <laughs> we t- I told you he killed him. And th- I said so many times that he was tossed in the water in spoiler, different spoiler, ways he died. I, 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 never do, I, never do the, I never do the wackening head. Let's that just spoil ending. a bunch of movies. This, this uh, Lord of the Rings, Gandalf gets absolutely his head cut Sixth off. Sense, he's dead the whole time. Fuck you. Yeah, uh, Sixth Sense has <laughs> always been dead. You know what's crazy? Was Niall obvious. didn't know that ending. I don't, I don't know if he was fucking with That's me. That's insane. I don't he, know if he was fucking with me or if he really didn't know, but he told me, I said... Like you, you've seen the Sixth Sense, and he was like, "No." I was like, "Do you know the ending?" And he was like, "No." And I was like, "You don't. You've never seen a parody or anything." Wow. Really? He's like, "No." So there are people out there that, that unless he was just fucking with me, I don't. Oh, there it is. <laughs> still not possible. But it sounded sincere. I don't think that's not, Niles. Kind of humor isn't that. I think he was telling the truth. To but, be honest, like I didn't really. I mean, I was young when I saw Sixth Sense, so when I found out the ending, it was it kind of surprised me. It is a good ending, even if you know it, even if you rewatch. Same thing with uh, no spoilers at all, but the movie Shutter Island. Mm-hmm. It's kind of a different movie if you rewatch it. Shutter Island. That's a good movie. It's about this guy who owns a shutter company for Windows. <laughs> and he has an island. He imports shutter them all over the island. He builds a big skyscraper out of shutters. I'm, I'm Leonardo DiCaprio. This that, is my that's island. That's the only plot. Shouldn't yep. shutter island. But then a, hor- a horrifying storm comes in and starts blowing all the shutters open. That's that shit with Dwayne yeah, and Rock every Johnson. Shutter, every shutter gets all blown of his right rats open. start escaping. He's like, my rats, my rat collection. R- Dwayne the Rock Johnson. So he has to work with uh, my rat colony. <laughs> he has to work with. Uh, he has to import a rat expert to get his rats back through the shutters. So you're the rat expert of it hearing about. Pleasure yep. to meet you. Pleasure to meet you, Doctor Ratsberg. Doctor Rat. <laughs> 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 Dr. Ratzberg, back at it again. I'm, your, I'm glad you called me. At your service. <laughs> he goes to shake his hand and it's a rat. Oh, you've been bamboozled. <laughs> he's rats for rats. Yeah, you've been bamboozled. Every part of his I body is a rat. I on my body. Be careful, <laughs> they do bite. They do bite. <laughs> I have four hands now, really. Don't look at my feet. You'd be scared. <laughs> oh, so Someone should inform him that I rat have rat I you for off hands. My, I think, I'm starting to think inviting you to my eye was a big mistake now. <laughs> Wait, so the Rat King, like, fucking created shutters on Shutter Island? Yeah. What is Shutter Sorry, Island? Sorry, we're spoiling the movie. That, that's <laughs> yeah, what that's happened. A, that's a huge spoiler. 
<laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's a fucking goal, dude. I love the idea of the rat man. He's got rats for hands and feet. He's got rat tails for hair. <laughs> Anytime he talks, the rats part of his fucking mouth. He's got a so rat garbled. nose for eyes. <laughs> <laughs> That'd be kind of gross. That's sick. And he wears a big, long, dirty cloak that smells like shit. That's just Bruno, dude. Bruno? Yeah, from Enchanto. I think you're talking about from Bruno from Bruno Mars. The movie. Yeah, no, the movie. full of rats. No, dude. no, the, the Borat movie. So I'm talking Bruno Mars. Oh wait, Bruno Mars is Bruno a singer. Bruno Mars is a singer. <laughs> no, he what has the rats hell? coming out of him too. I can't watch Encanto. Why? Because it's enchanting. No, because uh, I don't want to culturally appropriate what I'm looking at. Uh, well, Disney already did that for you, so. It's fair game. <laughs> 